Are you looking to do an e-bike conversion on your favorite bike, recumbent bike, or trike? Well, this video is for you. Hi, I'm Joel Leicatcher and I'm with Get Back Trikes and Bikes. I'm an e-bike conversion specialist specializing in recumbent bikes, trikes, as well as normal upright diamond frame bikes, mountain bikes, and all kinds of exotic bikes. If you are thinking about doing an e-bike conversion, you need to consider the type of bike you're riding and your lifestyle and your purpose because there are many different options. Mid-drive motors, hub motors, gear motors, direct drive motors. There's a lot of different considerations because the type of terrain you're riding on makes a big difference as well as your physical fitness. So a good place to start is to talk to a professional like myself. Maybe you might have a local bike shop that specializes in e-bike conversions. Unfortunately, most local bike shops lack the experience, knowledge, and the tools needed to do an e-bike conversion. That's why you should seek out a professional like myself. Look where you live. If you can't find one, feel free to give me a call in South Florida and I'll help you out as best I can. Here's a big tip. When talking to someone about doing an e-bike conversion for you, they need to do a few things. They should look at your bike and make sure it can support the weight of the battery and the hub motor and all the different components. And do they have a place for it to go? Is there a good quality place to mount the battery? A recumbent trike needs it a certain way. An upright bike needs it a different way. Also, they need to ask you about where you're riding. What's your lifestyle? What's the purpose of this e-bike? Is it a cargo bike? Is it a fitness bike? Is it a mountain bike? All these things come into play. Ask them if they have the right tools. Do they have work stands that can support the weight of an e-bike? E-bikes can weigh over 80 pounds when completed. If you ever looked at an e-bike in the store, they're really heavy. Why? Because people ride them like motorcycles. Now, you may not ride it that way, but if you have a quality built bike, and I mean a name brand bike, not a Walmart Huffy bike, for example. That would not be suitable. But if a name brand quality built bike that has good welds, it can generally support an e-bike conversion. Tell me if this sounds like you. You're a do-it-yourselfer, you thought, easy, I'll do it myself. You go on Alibaba, you go on eBay, you buy a kit and you get this box filled with a geared hub motor that has to be built into a wheel. You've got a controller, you've got a display, you might have a pedal assist sensor, and a speed sensor, and a battery, and a battery mount, and lots and lots of wires. And the instructions are minimal at best, or perhaps broken English, who knows. In any event, you might think this is above you because you don't have a stand that can carry the weight of building a e-bike on. You don't have the tools, you don't have the electronic testing equipment, and most of all, you don't have the experience. You say, aha, I'll call my local bike shop. They'll help me. Nah, -uh. most local bike shops don't have the knowledge, experience, or the tools to do an e-bike conversion. Matter of fact, many local bike shops call me here down in South Florida because this is beyond them. They don't wanna do it. They don't want the responsibility. They don't know how to tweak it. And I'm happy to fill that void. There's basically two different kinds of e-bike conversion systems. The value-based systems from places such as Alibaba and eBay, and the premium systems usually offered from companies such as Shimano, Bosch, and Falco. There's also a few brands that are very well known that come from other independent distributors, such as Bafang. And then there's some integrators. The one that comes to my mind is Grin in Canada, which looks at all these different independent parts and packages them into systems that they can support. And support is the most important part of this, because if you get a value-based system, you're on your own, you're not gonna have support. And when things go down, you're gonna be looking at a lot of YouTube videos and figure things out. How can you validate the difference? Well, used to be in days of computer, the mouse, a Windows mouse felt a certain way and a Macintosh mouse felt a different way. The premium systems feel like the smooth Macintosh mouse that works the way you expect it to and follows your intuition better. Here at Get Back Trikes, we specialize in premium systems. 
Sure, you can go buy one of the value-based systems and I'll install it for you and you'll be happy with it and I will support it best I can. But if you want a premium system, well, the one that I work with is Falco. Falco is an Indian company with great technology. It's not a Chinese company. Though there are some good Chinese parts out there, I like the value of the Falco integrated system. It still is open source in that you could buy third-party batteries and it's a little proprietary in that they have their own controllers and motors that are very integrated, very similar to the old Bionex system, which is now gone. But I think it's an improvement. You can install it faster and tighter because in the hub motor, it's a direct drive hub motor system, you have the speed sensor and the torque sensor, so there's no need to add an additional sensors on the cranks or a speed sensor on the rear wheel. Do we stock the Falco systems? Not all of it. Why? Because every installation is unique. When you buy the hub motor, whether it's a 750 watt or 500 watt, it has to be laced into a wheel because it is the hub motor. And your wheel is maybe different than other wheels. Is it a 26 inch wheel? Is it a 20 inch wheel? Is it a 700 wheel? I don't know. You may not even know, but I will figure it out and we will have the wheel custom built for you at the Velocity Factory in Colorado. Sure, it's an Indian company, but the wheels are built right here in the United States. Get Back Trikes is an authorized dealer and installer for the Falco eMotor Solutions. Now these are direct drive hub motors that offer things such as regenerative braking and button laced controls because I like buttons on my controls. I don't want to have to look at screens and touch around to find things. I want to keep my eyes on the road and know where those buttons are so I can increase my assistance or my regenerative braking or whatever else I need. And I want to know where that throttle is and make my trike go when I need a little extra assistance. Get Back Trikes is an authorized dealer and installer for Falco eMotor Solutions. Great e-bike conversion systems, premium products. They don't really have a premium price when you compare them to other high-end systems from Bosch and Shimano. They're actually a little lower priced. Sure, they're more than the Chinese knockoffs, but you're getting a much more technically advanced system and local support if you're here in South Florida, but we ship them all over the country to order and I can support you on the phone. So let's sum this up for you. There's two kinds of systems, value-based systems and premium systems. There are bike shops that know how to do e-bike conversions and there are bike shops that stay away from it. It's beyond their ability. We've got bikes that can support an e-bike conversion and some bikes that can't. So if you have any questions on this, Give me a call, Joel Lightcatcher at Get Back Trikes, 754-200-1884, or you can write me, joel at getbacktrikes.com. If you're in South Florida, give me a call. We'll go for a ride together, and I'll show you some e-bikes that I have myself. Anyway, thanks again. Hope to see you in the next video. Get Back Trikes is South Florida's only dealer for Falco eMotor Solutions, sales, service, and installation. Give us a call at 754-200-1884 and we can ship anywhere in the U.S. and service you anywhere in South Florida. I'm Joel Lightcatcher. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for other videos in this series.